The first thing I donated was to the Salvation Army was 500 pounds of chicken breast. It's bone skinless chicken breast. Uh, the company I delivered it to, they wanted four ounce packages and I had eight ounce packages. So they took and would not accept the delivery on it. So I was trying to think, you know, what could I do? And the very first thing that popped in my mind was Salvation Army. When, when I lost my job driving a truck, I took and I found myself in a predicament that, you know, I had to find myself out of it. And I was like, what am I going to do? I spent one night, you know, it was absolute, it was a blizzard. And I spent that night, and the next day is when I went to Salvation Army. And, you know, I was so cold. And then I see myself at uh, Salvation Army. I was warm, I had the support. But if I had never gone to Salvation Army, I would probably still be underneath a bridge or dead. I didn't have to worry about uh, where I was going to sleep at that night, whether I was going to be warm or I was going to have the food. So that took a lot off of me. And with that stress gone, I could sit there and think, you know, what can I do that's going to benefit me? I'm getting back on my feet. It made us grow to a better relationship together as brothers. But he was talking about his work history with them and you know, the way things were run. And he's been instrumental in helping me with my ministry in helping homeless here because I've actually got someone that's gone through a lot more than I have. I was very fortunate. But there's a lot of people that's been a lot less fortunate than I was that are still in the predicament they are now. And that's the people I hope to reach.